This is Math Studies section 2.1, Propositions. A proposition is a statement that can be um, deemed true or false. So, for example, 7 is a prime number. That is a true statement, therefore it is a proposition. Um, all cats have pink fur. That is a false statement, therefore it is a proposition. So any statement, if you can say true or false at the end, is a proposition. Um, will you marry me? Not a proposition. It might be a proposal, but it's not a proposition because it's not a statement that you can say true or false afterwards. So basically questions will never be propositions. Uh, negation is the negative version of a proposition. So if you can kind of think of like adding not to a proposition, that would make it the negative version or the negation. So the one that I did first was 7 is a prime number. I could say 7 is not a prime number. That would be the negation of 7 is a prime number. Or all cats have pink fur. How about no cats have pink fur? And uh, generally, if the proposition is true, its negation is false. And if a proposition is false, its negation is true. We have different symbols for negation. The one that you will find in the exercises is that symbol called a tilde, but that is going to be the negation symbol. Um, I don't really have a button for it, but I've also seen negation symbols that look like that. It's kind of like a negative sign, but with a little, I don't know, dip at the end. So both of those symbols will be negations. Okay, so we can go on to the exercises. Uh, examples. The first example says, is the statement a proposition? And if it's a proposition, state whether it is true or false. So 12 is an odd number. Yes, that is a proposition. Because I can say that that is false. Uh, 11 minus 4 equals 7. Yes, that is a proposition. And it is a true proposition. How tall are you is not a proposition. So I cannot say true or false afterwards. And example B is write the negation of the proposition. So the proposition is 3 fourths is rational. I will say 3 fourths is not rational. All squares are rectangles. Not all squares are rectangles. And the last one, 1 plus 2 equals 3. 1 plus 2 See if this works. Nope. Does not equal 3. So I'm trying to stick a does not equal symbol in there. I don't know my keyboard shortcut, but does not equal would look like that. So that's basically it for the first section. On your exercises, you will have to do the same for number one as we did in letter A. Say yes or no, and if you say yes, say true or false. And number two will be give the negation, just like we did in example B. Question number three, uh, there was some confusion when I did this in class, and basically they are not negations. This proposition and this one are not negations. Fix the second one to make it a proposition or to make it a negation. And that's about it. Uh, good luck with the exercises.